the iterator pattern is kind of the most simple of the design patterns. You have a set of items and you would want to loop around them. So the iterator pattern defines a way where you can loop around the objects in a collection. So it's defined as sequentially access the elements of a collection. A good real world example of an iterator pattern is the next previous buttons on a TV remote. As, as, as and when I keep pressing the next button, I would be switching to the next channel and so on. A good example of iterator pattern in Java is the iterator class itself. And also we have now the enhanced for loop and things like that, which help us to loop through the collection. Thanks for joining more than a million students who are learning from us. At In 28 Minutes, we defined a learning roadmap for Java and front-end developers. We created more than 25 courses covering all the topics that you are seeing on the screen. There are four things you can do to make best use of these courses. Number one is Udemy. You'll find a link in the description of the video to our Udemy profile. We are teaching a lot of courses on Udemy and most of them are free. Number two, visit our website www.in28minutes.com. You'd find tons of information including how you can register for our trainings and the link to Udemy and our GitHub code as well. Number three, visit our GitHub repository. With more than 20 repositories covering varied examples, it's a comprehensive source of information and code. Last but not the least, you'll find a set of discount codes for all our Udemy courses in the description as well. Feel free to use them. Good luck from the team here at In28Minutes, your destination for high quality step-by-step -step courses.